Supreme Court has overturned Roe versus Wade, and with their decision to overturn Roe, the Supreme Court has left it up to the states to decide about abortion. News 12's Chris Guin joins us live with what we can expect in Tennessee and in Georgia. Chris. Nearly 50 years after the Supreme Court ruled on Roe v. Wade, codifying abortion rights on the basis of a right to privacy, that decision has now been overturned. Now, laws have been triggered in several states which will greatly limit access to the procedure. In Tennessee, that means almost all abortions will become illegal in 30 days. With Roe v. Wade overturned, the Human Life Protection Act has been triggered in Tennessee, outlawing most abortions. The law prevents abortion at any point between fertilization and birth, with no exceptions for rape or incest. The only exception is for situations in which abortion is necessary to prevent the serious injury or death of the pregnant woman. So at the end of 30 days from today, then uh, anybody who performs an abortion will be guilty of a Class C felony. A Class C felony carries a penalty of 3 to 15 years in prison and a maximum fine of $10,000. There are no penalties for the person receiving the abortion. It gives a doctor with the ability to decide the, the status of the woman's life or being permanently dismembered in some way the ability to make a decision on the spot. In Georgia, overturning Roe likely means the heartbeat bill will go into effect, banning abortion after a fetal heartbeat can be detected. It, it sets the threshold of, of where we declare life in Georgia when, when there's a detectable heartbeat. You know, the, that's, it, we consider that human life and um, you, know, you can't abort, you know, you can't abort after that. The 11th Circuit Court will have to make a decision about the heartbeat bill before it becomes law. If it does, Georgia would allow for abortions after a heartbeat is detected in cases of rape and incest. A law triggered in Alabama makes performing an abortion a Class A felony, punishable by life in prison. In North Carolina, abortion will remain legal until the 20th week of a pregnancy. Live in the studio, Chris Guin, News 12 Now.